Bam! Two for two video. For those who live in Vancouver, you may know there's been a lot of snowfall this year. There hasn't been a major snowfall in the last few years in Vancouver because we're pretty modest in terms of weather and cold and uh, temperature, and it usually turns into rain before it turns into snow. Anyway, the last major snowfall was in 2008. The amount? Leroy? Uh, John, why am I not in any in, in YouTube videos anymore? Oh, hey guys, it's me, Leroy. Yeah, in 2008, it snowed a, a total of 109 centimeters. And, oh, and before that, before that, yeah, in 1996, it snowed 130 centimeters. Now you know. Thanks, Leroy. What was the total for 2016 and 2017 so far this year? I don't know. Uh, for 2016, a total of 28.4 centimeters of snow fell. After today's date, for 2017, a total of 31 centimeters of snow fell. For a total of 59.4 centimeters of snow. Now you know. Thanks, Leroy. Vancouver, we're used to rain. For those who don't know Vancouver, it rains quite a bit. But when it snows in Vancouver, everybody fails. The city stops. It just stops. People fail on a level that I, I don't believe. And most of it's common sense. Uh, let me give you a few examples. If you're wearing shoes without any tread or you're wearing sneakers, take it carefully on snow and obviously take it more carefully on ice because those shoes are not meant for snow or ice. You can always invest in a good pair of winter boots or even boots with spikes on them for ice. If you're freezing cold outside, common sense is to dress warmly. Stay inside. Don't complain about the cold. Stay inside. Dress warmly. If you can't afford clothing or shelter, that's a different topic. Oh, 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 me, 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 me. In Vancouver in 2016, the homeless count reached about 540 on the streets and about 1,300 in shelters. Now you know. Thanks, Leroy. Driving in snow. Fail, whale, galore. Snow gods save us all. Mother nature, have mercy. Winter and snow tires do help. Oh, oh, oh. Fact, winter and snow tires work best at temperatures 7 degrees Celsius and lower. Now you know. Always best to swap all four tires out. I know some people are, you know, can't afford winter tires and they swap the two rears or two fronts depending on what kind of car you have. If the other two summer tires or all season tires are sliding, guess where your car's gonna go? Sliding. You're not really gripping anything. You sort of wasted money on the two tires. So the front two tires are the weakest link. Goodbye. If ice is what you most often drive on, hopefully the city provides snow plows and salting for the major routes. It is ice that you mostly drive on. Invest in studded winter slash snow tires. They have little metal studs that come out and that give traction in the ice. Google it, YouTube it, you'll see it. Don't drive with worn out tires with no treads. I don't really care if you die with those bald tires, but you are endangering everyone else on the street, you idiot. Remember to clear all the snow on your car and don't do what this guy did. Yes, scrape off the ice as well. Don't do this. You can't afford to buy scrapers or you can't afford then improvise. Use something. Thanks for watching. Share like subscribe. M Square out. Hey guys, it's me Lamar. And Leroy too.